Now, of course, you're aware this is Native American Heritage Month. And I remember when I was a kid, there was no such thing. There were, maybe there was an American Indian Day, but the Coquels were terminated when I was growing up. And so somebody like me, looking like me, couldn't even say that I was Coquel, that I was Indian, because the federal government said that we weren't Indian. And so I pretty much dedicated my life into learning everything that I could about being Coquel. And I grew up right in the middle of it anyways, down on South Slough, Charleston of Coos Bay. How was it for you um, being terminated and then finding restoration? In 1954, I was four years old and uh, we were at a tribal council meeting of the Klamath and us kids played outside, of course, and the adults went in and the tribal members voted. And, and uh, it was a slow, sad ride home because mom was crying and dad was trying to comfort her. And we're asking her, what's wrong? And uh, she said, we're terminated. The federal government has terminated the Klamath tribe. And I was only four, but I knew something was wrong about termination and that we're gonna to have to go through it. And I didn't know how long it was gonna be and if it'd ever get over, but from from that time on I had to make I had to guide my life to to maintaining my identity as a Klamath Indian because I was kept on hearing people saying you're not an Indian anymore and I Mom and Dad always said, you're always going to be an Indian, that's who you are. I'm very happy that there's a Native American Heritage Month. Finally, it's a time where people will pay attention. I don't think we have yet utilized this month to best tackle some of the problems and issues that we have uh, here on campus, and I think we can do better. And the last part is that for some reason, Native American Heritage Month falls in November when Thanksgiving is. And for me, Thanksgiving is a day off. It's a day off I can spend at home with my wife and kids, but for many Native Americans, it's the beginning of promises unfulfilled. And it's just a reminder of what happened next. I wish Native American Heritage Month was in some other month, just to get it out of and away from what has been painted as a Native American holiday. And it is actually an American holiday. Thanks, Gordon. Appreciate you chatting with me. Yep.